Uh, the locks. I think I've already asked them about this, but why not? If you can possibly get the canal lock open, then the sailors will be able to tow the train up to the winding machine. Open the lock? What a singular idea! What a surprising request! Our university isn't responsible for the functioning of the canal locks. A different administration deals with that, miss. Here we are, busy chat-chatting, and look at the clock. It's tea time. Already? My word, doesn't time fly by? Thank you for a charming visit, miss. And thank you, gentlemen. Hmm. Right. That doesn't... Didn't bring any light from the lock situation, did it? Um, hmm. Can't interact with anyone in there. There's nothing in there, and I can't talk to the fellow in the lecture theatre, at least not yet. And I can't talk to you to get the coffee. Hmm. I wonder what I'm meant to do with the. Uh, let's. Right. No, no. Friends of Barak Shadad, prefaced by Professor Pons. Right. Uh, the young garlic cola is dried and ground to a powder and consumed before the hunt commences. Great distances. Okay, so maybe it's not useful for this bit. Hmm. At least not yet. Um. Let's talk to the barge people uh, as much as we can. Let's see if they say anything interesting from anything that we ask. Hmm. Hey there, on the boat. Good tag, cher de mademoiselle. My husband say, hello, young lady. You want to talk to us? My name is Kate Walker, and I'm a lawyer. I'm in charge of this train. This situation is really very new to me. Lawyer, good job. Earn lot of money. A lot? A lot? No, I wouldn't go that far. But I, I can't really complain, I guess. There's worse. Lawyer always ask a lot of money. Can we change the subject, please? I really don't want to go down this road. <laughs> right. Now that you've got your hundred dollars, can we take care of my problem? Okay. My exclusive My husband say we help you if you open locks. Yeah, right. How do I do it? We would save a lot of time if you came with me to work out how the lock system works. Schlechte Idee! A lot of Grishniks in Java Fred Watut Bordele kaputt das Machina. Don't you agree? We already accept the favor. If you want more, you pay more. That's out of the question. Too bad. I'm just going to have to work it out without your help. Then we're both stuck here forever. Fools. You must really get to see the countryside. Do you know New York at all? Yes, they get there on their we barge. We not understand. I'm looking for a funny little man who is supposed to live in Siberia. Can you imagine that? <laughs> Siberia. I expect you've already been there. Shivraga come to Siberia? Siberia? No. Too cold. Barge no break ice. I hope my train isn't too big for your barge. It's okay, Motormot, it's the class. My husband say, correct, powerful motor. I mean, we're not exactly very far from the winding machine, are we? It's dumb, isn't it, all this effort to go a few yards? Put train in barge? Nay, <laughs> not possible. Have you gone down to take a look around the station yet? It's amazing, you know, it's full of exotic birds. Me to my girl, yeah, <laughs> yeah, but pleasure. We no leave boat. Husband is landsick. 
Is it the locks that are stopping you from carrying on your journey? Da, barch no pass. Lock closed. Have you tried, like, just opening them? Nah, not possible. Have try. Now system kaput. Oh, dear. I am sorry about that. Looks like we're all being held prisoners in Barrackstadt then, in a way. Funny that, isn't it? I'll mm -hmm. leave you to it. I won't disturb you again. I promise nothing. I will probably bother you again. Repeatedly. Is that a six? Is that a six and a five? Just, just there, just above my cursor. Now it's gone. All right. We'll give that a go, and then we'll see what happens. Anything else scrolled along here? Or is that one something? I can see one over there. No. Four zero. Looks like a forty over there. Huh. I'm guessing I need to figure out how to do this. Maybe we can talk to Oscar, although I don't think he's going to be much use. Oh, actually, no, no, I was going to talk to um, Station Master, go through all his dialogue. Maybe we can do that with Oscar as well, although I think we've done quite a bit. We probably did some of that in um, Bala de Lien. I'm sorry to disturb you. What can I do for you, miss? I don't think you've been telling me the entire truth, Mr. Station Master. Now, wait a second. I, I never really intended you. You have to believe me. I can see I can't pull the wool over your eyes. You're pretty sharp. Or you're just not very good at lying. Mm. Oh, I'll never do it again. Promise. I've just been to see the Rectors, and they told me to get the train out of the station as quick as I can. Uh, I thought they'd say that. Rules are rules, and you gotta stick by them. Not a good idea to get into trouble with the university administration. A absolutely. I've got enough worries as it is. What should I do then? Well, uh, I suggest you move your train. But it's like I say, the springs are unwound. Everyone seems to think it's my fault. The locomotive's engine might not work, it's true, but maybe there's some other way of moving the train. Yes, I'm working on that. It's a possibility, I suppose. Uh, what were you thinking of exactly? Uh, nothing. It was just an idea. Anyway, miss, you shouldn't hang around here. I have a job to do. Yes, sirree. I feel like I've lost my way a little here. I could really do with your help. Hey, anything I can do, miss, you just let me know. The name Hans Varlberg doesn't mean anything to you by chance, does it? Oh, do you really think I'd remember one little name from the thousands that passed through this station? It seems that your superiors object to the presence of my train in the station. Not exactly easy going, are they? Uh, well, it's, it's not that they're difficult to please, but I find that the less I have to do with them, the better things are. Give a drift. Birds, more peaceful than employers. And respect for the regulations, now that brings peace of mind. All these birds in a station. It's amazing. This is no ordinary station, miss. Oh, no. These birds are part of the prestigious University of Baruchstadt Ornithological Collection. Over the years, this aviary has housed some of the most fantastic species from all over the world. And I am not exactly your typical station master, either. This little world is my responsibility, and that is no easy task. I can well believe you. And you know what's the hardest? The hardest thing is to keep interspecial harmony. And one day some explorer introduced a couple of cuckoos from the Amazon. Whoa. Terrible. It wasn't a good idea? No. A nightmare. 
You know, cuckoos lay their eggs in the nests of other species, right? Now, what's more, they also push the host's eggs out of the nest so that they receive all the mother's attention, right? Accursed cuckoos. Nightmare. I see what you mean. That's one tricky bird. And there was nothing you could do to stop it? The faculty declared the bird a protected species. If it wasn't for our mechanical eagle, we were sitting on a major ornithological catastrophe. You have an automaton here? A wonder of technology. It's an eagle that's mounted on rails in the air. It passes through and it swoops down to collect parasite eggs. But heck, the dang eagle's been out of order for several years. Impossible to collect the eggs myself. Why not? I, uh, I can't climb up the gangway. I fell off it several months back and I still have a pain in my spine. Not to mention the vertigo I've been getting. I only, only have to look up in the air. Whoa. You poor soul. That must be very hard. The worst thing is, cuckoo eggs piling up in the nests. Soon the rectors are going to notice. There's trouble in store. Big trouble. Well, I'm worried. Yep. Worried. And we've already asked about the locks. I won't disturb you any longer, anything. Mr. Station Master. Welcome to Barrokstad, miss. Well, we're going to talk to Oscar, I think. Maybe he'll have something to say. He might not, admittedly, but... Worth the go. I don't think you'll know how to use the locks, though, is the problem. Everything okay, Oscar? Yes, Kate Walker. I am awaiting your instructions. You must have seen that barge on the canal, Oscar? Well, that barge is going to help us by towing the train up to the winding machine. I've still got one or two matters to resolve, but they shouldn't take too long. I cannot help you in this matter, Kate Walker. River transport is not part of my mandate. Yeah, I figured as much, Oscar. I don't know why. Because you are very attentive, Kate Walker. Mm. Oscar, see you later, alligator. In a while, Kate Walker. Thought it'd be worth a try, but... Hmm. Hmm. I don't just want to sit there and press all the buttons, because I don't think that will actually achieve anything. Let's go back... Actually, let's go back to my room. See if there's anything there, although I don't think there will be. Something to drink, or something I could use. Oh, there's a feather bit around here. Oh, just a. Uh, cost of clothing. Dress thing. Coat? Probably a coat, actually. No there. point weighing myself down. But I want to see if there's anything in there that's useful. Look at. Hmm. Hmm. So I'm not sure what I'm meant to do now. That's frustrating. Hmm. Yeah, you're not going to help. You're not going to be any help with the lock, are you? So no one knows how the locks work. And I've got no way of seeing, the, of opening the, or looking at the instructions. Press To get an idea of what to do. And I'm assuming that you need to find read the instructions before you can just start randomly pressing buttons. Because hmm. I don't think there's any kind of hint other than this set of instructions that no one can read. Run, please. Thank you. Five is the one we had. Four one. I'm going through this again. I'm gonna. I'll try all of them. I suspect I've got. I can't just do that. 
I assume I have to... I should probably just use this anyway if it's directional. Seven, eight, nine, zero, seven, one. Yeah, so I get the feeling that we need to. Or maybe it's because I'm not waiting. But I suspect that I need to find out what the instructions say and then do that rather than. Press random buttons. Yeah, it's looking that way. Yeah. Don't think this is going to do anything. Don't think this area is actually worth anything for this. So I need to find the instructions a... are written yeah. in a language I don't recognize. So I need to do the instructions. I don't know. How, I don't know. Clearly, I need some other thing, some other item. Grab that. Okay. I was wondering if you could like use the faxes and use the fax. But even then, you don't have anything to kind of do a uh, uh, rubbing with, do we? We need like some charcoal for that, or a crayon or something. Pencil actually would work quite well for that. But I don't have anything like that. I don't have... yeah, the hook's not going to do anything, the wine bolt's not doing anything. Like I can't combine items. I don't think there's a way to, is there? No, it doesn't look like there's a way to. Hmm. Once again, I'm stumped. Because there's no one that we can interact with up here, is there? Oh, like, I can't interact with him. Can't give him anything. The rectors won't take anything I've got, and they are no use. I have to think there's like a glass somewhere that we put the wine in, then the cola in, then we drink it, which lets us see the. This is a way of curing the land sickness of the fellow. And he comes up, and we bring both of them up to have a look at the instructions. I mean, that's, that's the only thing I can think of. Well, I think we'll stop here while I'm still completely and utterly baffled by what I'm meant to do next. Once again, what a way to end. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching.